this video I will show you how to use the iExtreme Ratio computer for a nitrox dive. I will show you how to set it up and how to use it during the dive. Let's set up first the gas mix that we are gonna use during the dive. So enter the main menu, select the mix table menu, enter and specify the nitrox that you are gonna use. For example, let's set up a 32% of oxygen nitrox. This means that our maximum depth is 34 meters. Let's set up now the deep stops. Enter the main menu, select dive settings and go to parameter deep stop. Let's use the standard algorithm for the deep stops. Exit the menu. Let's now simulate our nitrox dive. We are gonna perform a dive down to 28 meters. In this main screen, we have different indications. Here on the top, we have our actual depth. In the middle, we see which is the, the dive mode, this means open circuit, and the algorithm that we are using, that now is Bullman. On this side, we have the dive time. In the middle, we have the non decompression limit. In the last uh, part of our screen, we have the gas mix that we actually are breathing. The maximum PPO2 of our gas that we are breathing and the descent and ascent speed. During the dive, we can access to other information. Let's see how. With the last button, we can see the temperature, the average depth, the maximum depth, the conservatism of our algorithm, the O2, the CNS value, the graph of our dive, the tissue saturation and if we want to navigate we have access also to our compass. In the compass you can set up the direction that you want to follow and the computer will automatically calculate the reciprocal. Once you are outside the main direction, the computer will signal you with green arrows how to go back to your main direction. The compass is still calibrated up to 85 degrees. During the ascent, the computer will show us the deep stop. In this example, the deep stop is at 14 meters and you must stop for two minutes. During the compression, we can access to the complete table of the decompression stops. So we can check for each decompression stop depth the time that we have to wait at that deco stop. Thank you.